Hello dear viewers all. On this video, I will show you the 5 best Windows 11 hidden features that will change your computer use to a better and enjoyable experience. In accordance to the positive predictions of our subscribers and the reputable reactions to all channels videos, we have carefully picked the 5 most amazing and practical features out of many Windows 11 features that everyone is in need. So you must know and apply all of them right now, to take your daily computer use to a smooth and enjoyable level. Let's see what Windows 11 features should be turned on. First part, how to enable emoji, GIF, symbols, and clipboard history in Windows 11. Press Windows logo plus V keys from keyboard to show clipboard history. A small window with multiple panels will pop up. Click on turn on option to enable clipboard history. On the clipboard history panel, everything you have copied will be shown in a separated entry, including screenshot images. There is an option to pin one or more items from the list to keep them for further use even after shutting computer down. Also you can clear all except pinned entries by clicking on clear all option. To use any entry from clipboard in any app, select that item and it will be pasted to the active text editing window. Next to clipboard panel, there are other panels or menus, which are, symbols menu, kemoji menu, gif menu, emoji menu, in addition to menu of most recently used icons. Every panel has sub menus with different groups of items. All menus are available offline except the GIF menu, which require an active internet connection to show up. To use any emoji or GIF in any text app or to add it to a chatting message, select the desired one to paste it to the active text editing window. If you like this feature, please leave a comment to this video, including the most common emoji you are using in your chats, and or the new one that you may added to your favorable list. Second part, how to enable multitasking features. From search box, type multitasking, and then select multitasking settings from search results. From multitasking settings menu, enable title bar window shake option. This option will help you to minimize all opened windows or apps except the active one, instead of minimizing every app separately. To do that, click and hold the title bar of any windows or app and shake it by moving mouse back and forth or left and right. Also you can press windows logo plus D keys from keyboard to minimize or to restore all opened apps or windows at once. The D stands for desktop, so it's used to show or hide desktop even in Windows 10 or Windows 8 or older versions. The second multitasking feature is the Snap Windows option. This option will help you to automatically resize and split opened apps into two or three or even four windows easily. To do that, hover over Maximize icon of any opened app, or press Windows plus Z keys from keyboard to show a menu of available layouts. Click on any zone to snap the active app or window to the selected zone. After that, use Snap Assistance to snap other windows to different zones. In Windows 10, you can press Windows logo plus one of the four arrow keys from keyboard to snap the active window or app to the side of the pressed arrow key. Third part, take and save a full screenshot or a modified snip by just one click. Press Windows plus print screen keys, and the screenshot image will be saved to the screenshots folder inside pictures folder. Print screen key is usually located upper right of keyboard next to F or functions keys, and its abbreviated name is PRTSC. To customize screenshot before saving, press Windows logo plus Shift plus S keys to capture and then select all or part of desktop screen. After selecting the part of PC screen, a notification pop-up from Snip and Sketch app will show in the left lower corner, so click it to edit and then save the image to any folder. There are other screenshot options other than rectangular snip option. For example, you can take a full screen snip including taskbar, window snip for the active app window only without taskbar, or freeform snip to freely select a part of the active screen window. Fourth part, create multiple virtual desktops with different backgrounds for each one. Hover by mouse over task view icon on taskbar and then select new desktop window to create a new desktop. Hover again over task view icon. Right click on desktop 2 window and select choose background option. Choose a different desktop background to help you differentiate desktop 2 from desktop 1. Fifth part, additional Windows 11 tips and tricks. Press Windows plus X keys to open start menu options. Press Windows plus E keys to quickly open file explorer. Press Alt plus Tab keys to show and switch between opened apps or windows. To navigate between opened windows, Hold Alt key down and press Tab key repeatedly. To show opened windows in 3D like Aeroflip 3D in Windows 7 and Windows Vista you have to install a third-party app like WinFlip tool. WinFlip is a free tool that can be used without installation. After extracting WFlip 050.zip file, double-click the EXE file to start the tool in background. After that, 
click its icon from notification area and scroll back and forth by mouse to start 3D flip show. Also you can press and hold Windows plus shift keys down and then press tap key repeatedly to explore opened app windows in 3D view. Press Windows logo plus L keys to quickly lock your screen so no one can access your account on PC. Finally, if your computer gets freezing due to not responding app, press Ctrl plus Alt plus Del keys from keyboard and then select, Task Manager option. Click on More Details option if all processes not shown. From Processes panel, right click on the problematic app and select, End Task option. For other Windows 11 features like running Android apps and other new features, or if you have an issue with any feature, refer to video description or post your issue in a comment and we will help you. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, leave a comment and subscribe.